hi guys welcome to my swap hop video um i hope that you've watched all the other videos and come through to me through that watching all of those and thank you very much for that so i was lucky enough to have mike deakin send me loads of wonderful happy mail so these are all the wonderful things he sent me i'm really 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 lucky so it's been like um he's sent me textbook pages um dictionary pages there's so much here to go through. Magazine cuttings and beautiful um, pictures, which is beautiful. Um, lovely vintage photographs, which is one thing that I will definitely be using. Um, old bingo card, some paper doilies, um, some nice patterned papers. Um, I said the stamp, oh, this vintage ticket, which I won't be able to use that. I'll have to photocopy that before I use it because it's just too precious. Um, some lovely pieces of paper. Um, this lovely 12 days of Christmas toppers. These, which are really nice. These are some lovely, lovely um, tickets that have been sent through as well with some lovely sayings on, so they're really nice. And some ribbon and some nice paper, well some nice, I think this is probably some like sweet paper like in a packet or something, but it's got some lovely design on the front as well and it sounds nice too. <laughs> and some ribbon so thank you very much for that mike i really do appreciate it so today i'm going to be doing it's a 10 minute video so i'm going to be doing a quick project so what i've decided i'm going to be doing um stickers so the reason why i've decided to do these is because i think that if you make stickers it's more um versatile you can use them then to either go on to a envelope or you can use them to put onto cards i've got some little cards here so you can make them into sort of like a little notelet or you could use them in a piece on their own um you know to decorate or whatever work that you were working on so i quite like this girl so i'm going to be using her because i've got to use five things so that's my first thing I'm going to be using. The other thing I'm going to be using is these two pieces of paper because I want to take the flowers out to put them into her hair. I'm going to be using also the dictionary paper and the nice heart doily. using that and also the tickets as well i'm going to be using probably quite a few of these tickets so i want some more in but i'm going to be making i think more than one sticker anyway today so let's get on with it this is contact here contact paper which to me is like a sticky back plastic so this i'm really sorry about the lighting but it's really hard because obviously it's shiny so it's really hard to not have a shine coming off so let's get on with making this i just decided to do a voiceover over this section and i hope that's all right all I've done here is cut down the postcard that Mike has kindly sent me. I am putting some of the flowers from the other piece of paper onto the headband just to make it look a bit more colourful. I do sort of like mess about with these quite a bit and then decide on which, which ones I want to use. I've just stuck those down with Pritt Stick. It might have been nice as well to have, have been able to have coloured this in, but I had nothing appropriate to colour it in with. Um, here I'm just making some wings to go onto the back, just to make it look a little bit more like a fairy. I'm using the textbook page that Mark has kindly sent. Just folded it in half just so I can get the wings symmetrical. And then just going to place it on underneath 
the um, image of the girl. Here I've just got one of the paper doilies, the circular one, cut it in half and you can just see me folding it up now to um, to make sort of like a nice fold to go behind to make it look a bit more, the wings look a little bit more pretty. Here I'm just putting the image onto the wings that I've created. I was quite pleased really with how it's turned out. And then all I did was punch into a book text page with um, my heart stamp and I'm just putting the the sort of like the outside of it sticking that down and then I like to go into it with some scissors some fringe scissors so it looks a little bit nicer on the bottom here I'm just going into with some gel pen just to make it look a bit prettier and then the last thing is I am putting some glue on the back and sticking the image down to make it into a sticker if you wanted you could put some sticky tape over the top as well but I don't really want to with this one I think it looks nice as it is just cutting around it taking the excess off and to be honest I might scan this in as well and create multiple stickers as well well guys there's my completed little sticker I don't know whether you hopefully you could see from the video everything I was doing I've used five items because I've used obviously the picture and I've used two different the flowers from the two different pieces um, I've used some of the doily and also obviously the text page as well so that is it is five items really I know it's a bit it's a bit cheaty I did want to put some text on it but it just doesn't doesn't look right so I'm going to leave it at that um obviously on the back all I've done is put some um some of the contact all I did was glue it down onto the contact so then what you can do it's completely up to you because like tonight I'm not in the mood for doing a journal page I'm just in the mood for like this could be like an embellishment on a journal page you know I'm not in the mood for getting my paints out and everything I'm just in the mood to play with paper so to speak so this is just a nice idea you could either stick it in a journal page like I said put it in a put it on a card or um you know on an envelope so really it makes it more more versatile and also it's great you can make loads of them and then put them to one side and then if you want to if say you're in a rush and you're sending out a swap or something and you want to put a little card with it you've got a piece of your own artwork ready to use on on your note um on your, on your card or whatever you want to put in there so i hope you've enjoyed the idea and as always please like comment and subscribe and do not forget to go and watch the next video on the list. And I hope you've enjoyed yourselves. Bye.